Hi, this is Zeus the Sparky over here and in today's quick tutorial video we'll be talking mainly about how to wire up the Micro 810 controller. As you can see over here I took a quick picture of my controller and put it onto paint old school. And yeah, we're just going to use some colouring brushes just to show you how the wiring's done. Okay, just get the size over here. Okay, so my model is 2080LC1012QWB, which is a 24 volt DC controller. I wanted to work with 24 volts as it's um, safer to use, and yeah, basically for 24 volts, just make sure you're transforming the 240 voltage coming out of your um, main power socket in down to 24 volts you don't want to put 240 onto these controllers as you'll blow something up inside of them okay so just to simplify things okay you got um you got the supply volt supply going up here for the controller you need 24 volts positive and 24 volts negative coming here so just draw a red line and black line here okay so that will be the supply for your controller Okay, up on top you got all the inputs. Okay, see the inputs are powered by 24 volts. The inputs will activate when 24 volts come to them. Okay, so how does the input work? Okay, so basically um, you will have a 24 volt active. Okay, write 24 volts here just so it should. Then you'll be coming to some sort of switch, um, whatever switch you want. It could be a push button switch. It can be um, it can just be a normal rotating switch. It can be yeah, and just any type of normally open switch which you close and it powers up. Or it could be a uh, normal yeah, normally closed or normally open depending on what function you want to use. And yeah, that comes into that comes into the input over here. And as with every circuit, it needs a return voltage to complete the circuit. So this is where the com comes in. So this goes back to 24 minus 24 negative and you can share it with the supply voltage if you wanted. And okay, the fun part about this is that you can piggyback the 24 volts off here, go to a different switch and then yeah, you go down into the second input and okay, so the thing with this um this um, neutral coming out of com this covers for these four and then if you want to use the other four then you gotta run another another neutral from here to 24 negative and then yeah wire up this wire up this output to 24 volts okay so the outputs on the bottom or on the bottom of the controller as you can see here they just act as relays okay so once Okay, so when we program the controller to close a certain output when a certain input is activated, the relay will close and will this will go from normally open to normally close and close this circuit. So what we do, okay, neutral is independent, so we, there's no neutrals down here, it's just um, a relay for the actives. Okay, over here it doesn't have to be 24 volts, we can go up to 240 volts for normal use. Okay, so what happens? We get the we get the common active put into CM zero, CM one, CM two. Okay, and then the active comes up into whatever we want to use. Just say we want to turn a light on, then the active comes to a light, and then yeah, from there we get the neutral and take it to its neutral source, and we do the same over here. Okay. Uh, and that will be output number two and basically that's how yeah that's how it's very simple that's how you wire up the micro 810 controller okay in the next episode we'll be showing you how to update the micro 810 controller as with all software it's good to have it updated to the latest version um there's well we hope that the software engineers for this hardware try to keep the um, software running as efficiently as possible and yeah having the um, latest or they call it revisions the latest revision will help us in doing whatever we want to do and then hopefully the next video after that will just be basic ladder programming okay 
So if you like these videos, make sure you subscribe, comment any comments you have below, and of course hit that like button and share it with other people who want to get into Allen and Bradley programming. Okay, this is Zeus to Sparky. Um, see you guys next time.